So the first thing when you come in my room is the door. It came with like the the hangers on the back of the door. So I hang some of my hoodies and my coats and stuff up there at the front door. So it's nice and convenient to get to them. And yeah, that's the front door. And then there's this little entrance section. I keep like my slippers here because I wear them whenever I leave my room. And then whatever shoes I am wearing the most at the time, I will leave here just because I wear them so much. There's no point keeping them in the wardrobe. If we come here, we have the, the chest of drawers. This came with the room. The landlord actually wanted to throw it away because it was kind of like broken and dying, but I needed the shelf space. So I convinced him to keep it here. Um, and I use this to store my most of my clothes in anything that doesn't hang up in the wardrobe is in here and then on top of the drawers i keep a bunch of stuff so at the back here i have the entirety of the marvel cinematic universe on dvd and then i have a bunch of the x-men universe films we've got x-men deadpool and then we've got the maze runner series how to train your dragon descendants and then some random one-off films as well this shelf has like changed along with my bookshelf over there over the past year because when i came i collected mostly books and so this was mostly books and that bookcase was mostly books as well and i had a bunch more books here but then i started collecting k-pop albums that took up all my shelf space so i ended up taking most of my books back home which is why i don't have that many books here anymore but i decided to keep the dvds here just because i just i like having all my marvel dvds here even though i don't use the dvds to watch it because i have disney plus but i just think it's so satisfying to look <laughs> but these are some of the books I did keep here. So I've got the Infernal Devices because this is the book series I'm currently reading. And then I've got One Kick, another book I did start reading. These are my theatre scripts. And then we've got Andy Mientis's backstage of books. Then on top, I've just got a bunch of random stuff that I don't really have room for anywhere else. I've got these two little plushies of Captain America and Iron Man. This is the bear my parents bought me to say well done for getting the unconditional offer that I got at the university I am now attending. And then I've got these two special edition Funko Pops. And then we've got like this random BTS stand I got from a store here in Southampton. And then this cute little photo of me, Nicola and Chloe, which Chloe got me for my 21st birthday in this frame, which is cute. Yeah, and then in front of it, I've got this photo of me and my best friend Stephanie with Carrie Hope Fletcher when we met her after Les Mis. I've got these little Into the Spider-Verse blind bag figures, which I got, and then I've got a clock and some Spider-Man Funko Pops and the Spider-Gwen from Into the Spider-Verse. I've got this photo of me and my family at Disneyland. And then I've got my masks. I've got this box of disposable ones. And then these are like my fabric ones, which I have. And then these are my keys to the flat with this really cool lanyard, which I got recently, actually. If we move to this corner here, down here, I keep a bunch of random stuff. So this is the bag I take to uni. It's currently got everything that I need for uni in it. Yes, this is a 24 pack of what sits that I do buy for myself, but I also use this now as a snack bag. So any snacks that I buy, I keep in here. And then underneath here, we've got an Ikea box. And this is where I keep my stuff for the kitchen. Um, I think most of it is actually in the kitchen at the moment because it needs washing but i've got like my cutlery here i keep like my plate my bowl all my kitchen stuff i keep in this box here so that no one else can use it so on top of the wardrobe up here i have a bunch of stuff i have those two ikea boxes and those are full of like random bits and pieces that basically don't belong anywhere else in my room and that i don't actually actively need and then you can see i have some wig stands and I've got a mannequin head because I have started cosplaying again and that's basically where I'm keeping all of my wigs at the moment. I've got my Levi Ackerman wig. Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I've got his wig up there and that's also a spider Gwen wig. To the side here, I've got a bunch of boxes from when I've done group orders. I fold up the boxes and put them there so that I can use them when I pack stuff up to move back home. Um, on this side, I've got a bag of bags. This whole Spider-Man bag is full of a bunch of other shopping bags and i've got my descendants bag and my other spider-man bag in there and so when i go shopping i'll grab some of those bags to take with me i've got this really cool my hero academia banner at the side here which is really cool and then on the doors i've got a levi ackerman banner and i've got my attack on titan scout cape 
which is for my cosplay but i like to keep it on the door because it just it looks really cool so i keep it there and it goes with the levi banner and then on this door is my betrayal poster i saw tom hiddleston and charlie cox perform in london it was really cool and i got the poster then inside my wardrobe my jumpers t-shirts over here i've got a bunch of cosplay stuff i think there's my spare duvets and sheets for the bed this is my backpack and behind it i've got like all my different bags as well this is a spare blanket behind it is my attack on titan cosplay harness so there's a bunch of random stuff up there oh look there's a slytherin tie here apparently as well and then down here i've got a spare pillow Here's where I keep all my spare towels. That is my dance bag full of all my dance shoes and then all my other shoes are on the rack here. Then the only other thing on the side of this room is the, the Marvel wall. So my posters, I have three walls of posters on. We've got the Marvel wall, the K-pop wall and the everything else wall. And this Marvel one is probably one that has changed the least over the past two years. And this is exactly how I had it when I first moved in two years ago and it has remained the same. The only difference is I had a bunch of other pictures um, up in the gaps like here. You can see um, the, the wall shows where there was stuff stuck to it and I had a bunch of little bits stuck up there but they all fell down and I couldn't be bothered to put them back up again so that's why there's gaps but originally the entire wall was completely covered now it is just all the big posters I I really love this layout because I just have all four Avenger films in order next and it just it looks I think it looks so good and I absolutely love it so you've got avengers age of ultron infinity war endgame then i've got captain and marvel there and <laughs> into the spider-verse another avengers one there and then these are the endgame posters that you got when you went to see at the cinema next we have this fireplace section this did used to be completely covered in photos i had photos like completely covering it including that white bit back there but again they fell down and i just never bothered to put them back up again so what you see on it so far is is just the ones that have actually been able to stay up for the past two years and haven't fallen off this is a birthday card my sister gave me and then in the center here are some of the books i kept here with me i've got my harry potter box set all my maze runner books and one of my harry potter and the cursed child scripts that book i literally bought the other day it's the latest one in the eldest curses which is basically an entire series following magnus and alec aka my favorite ship and couple and my favorite characters in the entire shadow hunter universe so yeah i got that book as soon as i found out that it came out and that just sits there and then this trophy is for my university's hip-hop team which i coached and performed in we got second place at heart of england and this is the trophy that we got and then over on this side is a photo of me and my family at disneyland and that is a card i think one of my lecturers gave me at the end of second year then if we go up the top of the mantelpiece is quite chaotic it's just a bunch of random stuff we've got these these fairy lights from primer i've got one of my water bottles a picture of me and tom holland that's my airpod pro case picture of me and andy mientes and here i've got like this pin board and i've got my dan and phil interactive introvert pins and then i've got pinned up this wristband i got at sean mendes's illuminate tour when i saw that in london that is a random unofficial band and then this i got at the dan and phil interactive introverts tour someone made that for me that is my pandora bracelet and this is the wristbands that we wore at Shawn mendes the tour ignore the dust pretend you do not see the dust i've got harry potter candle my phone box oh yeah just random batteries i don't know why and then i've got a framed photo of the london cast of the view upstairs and then here on this side i have a hook which has basically all my cheer and dance stuff i was part of the university's cheer and dance society like i mentioned i coached and was in the hip-hop team i also did pom in the second and third year as well this was our training bow in first year this was our training bow in second year and this was the pom performance bow that we wore uh, to perform at competitions during second year underneath are all the medals that we got whenever you go to a cheer and dance competition you will get a medal of like participation and these are literally all the medals that i got this was my id for one of the for one of the competitions and then above the mantelpiece is my random poster wall of random stuff this one has changed a little bit over the past two years i had my portal 2 one up there but i recently got the my hero academia one and i switched to that and then i also made myself a view upstairs poster 
Potter, which I put there. And then it's just Harry Potter, How Train Dragon 2, and Supernatural. Then we get to this corner, and I guess I could deem this a little K-pop corner. This is where my K-pop album collection is in all its glory. I will be uploading a separate tour video going through my entire album collection, so I won't go into detail now, but I've got Stray Kids, T.O., BTS, Blackpink, Day 6, Khan, Minju, The Ark, Super M, 80s, EXO, NCT, and a little bit of TXT there. Confetti from a Day 6 concert, and then my Super M Marvel lanyard. Then in the side down here, that's my Love Holic album because it doesn't fit on the shelf. And then these are my photo card collection binders. And then in this little corner here, that's my Super M collection. That is like spare photo cards that need to be traded or sold, and a bunch of other stuff in there. I think like gone business cards and stuff as well. That is my macbook bag and box that has a bunch of like important random stuff in that i don't want to throw away and then this is my captain america shield because i have a captain america shield it's cute up here we've got my calendar this is actually a 2020 calendar but obviously i didn't get to use it that much because i had to go home during the first lockdown and ended up being home for nearly half the year so the months that i didn't get to use i am using for 2021 so obviously it's like the wrong days but I just use it to count down the dates. Cross off where we get to, it's the 22nd today. <laughs> and I'm counting down to Ghost, which is our university musical performance, which is next week. This is my timetable whiteboard where I write my timetable. This is the week we've just had. Then we get to the desk section in all its glory by the windows. It's like a little window bay. It's actually really nice. There's not really much on the actual windowsill, just some frames. There's one of me and Andy Mientes, me, Nicola and Chloe at the BTS, concert of ours with a rose that i got um during the final show of flash dance last night then the desk if we start here this is like another a little drawer in this bottom drawer i keep stuff for k-pop trading i've got like top loaders third drawer is like a bunch of random stuff that just doesn't go anywhere else this one is like kind of electric sort of things and then this top one is like the stationary one and then on top is kind of like my hair station uh, for when I do my hair in the morning. Um, I've got alcohol wipes here um, that I use when I get home after being outside. There's this mirror which came with the flat. It's like broken, but I found it quite useful because I don't have any other mirrors in my room. I've got all my scrunchies over it as well and my headband which is handy got some cotton buds there got my hairbrush here this is for my olivia octavius cosplay and then i've got this little tray it's got my skincare stuff hair care stuff that is everything on there underneath the desk i have my laundry basket where all my dirty clothes go and then down here i have a pack of covid tests as i have to take those for university at the moment and then this is my gom station if you've seen some of my live streams and that you will know that i I've done group orders for K-pop albums and this is basically where I keep everything for that. So I have like bubble wrap, spare envelopes and cardboard. These are poster tubes and basically anything I might need to pack and post K-pop albums and photo cards. Then we have the actual desk and these desks were like new um, when we moved in. They replaced the old desks that were here and it's nice and big and I have a lot of stuff on it. This stationary thing and I've got like a bunch of random stuff in the back here. Hole punch. Actually, my hole punch is not there. I think one of my flatmates took it. There should be a hole punch there, <laughs> along with my stapler. And then in here, I've got mini pegs, pins, and paper clips. This is my biscuit tin that I keep biscuits in. It's currently empty, which is really sad, but I'll buy like random biscuits and just keep them in there to snack on during the day. My Hero Academia mouse pad, which I bought. I don't have a mouse, so I don't actually need a mouse pad. But it was My Hero Academia and looked really cool, so I just have it there as a uh, de decoration. On the side of the drawers here, I have this mini whiteboard where I currently have all the YouTube videos that I need to film and edit. Then here's all my notebooks. Uh, these are textbooks for uni, and then these are all notebooks. These are my journals, notebook, that's my planner. This is a Captain America thing that has all my BT21 pens in. I've got these baskets with Sharpies and other 
felt tips in. This is my My Hero Academia mug, which has red red feathers in it, literally just red feathers. If you watch My Hero Academia, you will you will understand why I have a mug of red feathers. Then this is a Peter Pan notebook I got from the Disney store because I adore Peter Pan and this notebook is so pretty and it's like a velvety material and it's just so nice. So I have that there on display. This is my group order manager business cards. I got some stamps. And then in here are all my K-pop freebies that I've either made or been given. Then I've got a frame with a photo of my family and Tom Holland. And then I've got this like paper holder. Underneath is my old laptop. This is a bunch of random stuff. I think this is sheet music. And ah, oh, Marvel coloring books, because why not? This is spare paper and card. This top one has all my paper pads in it with, um, spare lined paper then at the corner i've got another coaster for my drink i've got this cd player i currently have exo mama in it just because i can use it as a mirror <laughs> which is fun and then i've got this lamp for the desk as well and then this is a tripod which is attached to the desk so whenever i do a live stream on tiktok or i want to film a tiktok sat at my desk i can just put the phone in here and it will be instantly ready to go. And down here, I've just got my plug extension thingy with my MacBook charger in and the lamp. And then I've got my bin. This down here is a little K-pop section. So in here is basically Funko Pop boxes, spare posters. And here we've got all my K-pop concert banners. So if you've ever been to a K-pop concert, you will know that everyone in the audience gets handed a banner, which they will hold up during a song. And these are all the ones that I've gotten at concert. And that is a premium junk photo I got at the Love Yourself tour. Then we have my bedside, my bedside table. So in here I have my pajama drawer, plasters, bin bags, duster, makeup wipes, bunch of like random stuff like that in there. And then this is like the electronics drawer or something and then on top of it we have a lamp we've got my tissues which i put into this this marvel box it doesn't stay done up but a coaster with my drinks bottle wireless charger my glasses case with some glassy lens cleaners and my glasses we've got a marvel alarm clock some vaseline some hand cream my blindfold and my moisturizer gloves then we come to the actual the actual bed it's a double bed first time i've ever had a double bed it's very nice at the top here i've got a bunch of cushions ikea dog plushie which my sister got for christmas for me because of sungmin from stray kids got a marvel cushion and a bts cushion and then that's my bear which i sleep with got my double duvet then i've got a single duvet and then I've got a blanket because I get really cold at night, so I need layers. <laughs> and then finally, we have the K-pop wall, which is all K-pop posters that have come with my albums. And this has changed loads throughout the past two years. When I first moved in, it was completely covered with BTS posters. And then it's gradually like changed over the past two years. And this is the final layout. I've got Super M here, some NCT here, two 80s posters here, day six, and then two Stray Kid ones. And yeah, that is the, the layout of the K-pop wall at the moment. And that is my, my bedroom. That is everything in my room.